Hey guys, it's Tiffany. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you the new Mr. Potato Head finds that I found at Target. I actually unboxed these, I want to say over a year ago. I found Series 1 on Amazon and I happened to be at Target and the box said Series 3. I'm not sure how accurate that is because the pictures actually look like Series 1. And then at Target, I also found in the dollar section these really cool themed color forms. They're Mr. Potato Head themed. You also see Mrs. Potato Head. She's got a really cute high ponytail. And your kiddos can tell a neat story with color forms. Color forms are really, really awesome. They are easy cleanup, reusable, fun on the go, and they also promote storytelling. So I love that. And I'm going to unbox these for you guys too. Check out my other Mr. Potato Head videos. I'll just put them um, a link for my playlist at the top of your screen. So if you're new to my channel, please don't forget to like this video and please subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. And if you aren't new here, welcome back. Let's get started. Now, what's great about this is that the price is actually right. It's only three bucks. This has a handle for easy transport. And it's a lot of fun for little kids, especially if you're a nostalgic parent like me. I had color forms growing up. So having something that I had when I was a kid that brought me so much joy brings, and brings my kid joy, brings me even more joy. So let's be joyful and give our kids things we like. This is nothing. Okay, so it has like a bunch of different facial expressions, which is also really, really great for toddlers. So you can teach your toddler about emotions if they are using this. And if you have a little kid at home, maybe like around a seven-year-old per se, like my kiddo, um, this is great for them too. Just like Mr. Potato Head and Miss Potato Head, you have different arms. Like usually it's the same arm for the actual figure, but with the color forms, the world is our oyster with our arms. We also have fun accessories like hats, even a microphone. We even have evil Dr. Pork Chops hat. Woof, 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 woof. That's the one that Ham wore. On the next page, we have some blank potato heads here where you're gonna express yourself or your kiddo's gonna express themselves with their own take on Mr. Potato Head. And it's a nice thick piece of cardstock. We also have them rocking out. Potato Head as the drummer. Their band is called The Yams. I love that. And it's just a lot of little, like, it's just a lot of fun. There's just so, there's just so many different ways that you can decorate. I love that. So I'll just give you a quick tutorial of how it's done if you've never, ever seen color forms before. These are a fun and unique way to play. And I love that it stands up. Check that out. A nice easy spiral binding so you can fold over each page easily. And then if you're playing tabletop, this actually stands up. Let's see how well it does. Let's see how well it does when we rip off the stickers though. Now what's great about color forms is that they peel off. They're not sticky where they're gonna stick to anything. They only adhere to the actual page of the color form. So when you're putting it down, look at that, it stays and then you could easily take it back off and then replace it. So now we have a reusable toy for $3 for your kiddos. Let's have fun with one of them. Ready? Ooh, look at that. Have you ever seen Mr. Potato Head look like that before? This is Punk Rock Potato Head from the Yams. I'm not going to go any more into it only because I want this to be a quick video. And plus I want my kids to enjoy it. If you want me to if you want to see me actually do it, put in the comments and I'll gladly do a video for you. Right now, I really, really want to open up these because I want to know if I really should go back to Target and get more. Now, if you're a fan of my channel, you probably already saw me open these up. I might not even have posted them, come to think of it. However, these Mr. Potato Head tots are really, really cute. They're smaller versions of Mr. Potato Head and the actual container is what you're gonna decorate. So what's inside is a surprise. So you don't know what style you're gonna get. Oh, and it looks like we got a witch. Let's check out that checklist before. I do see some remnants of series seven. Now what's great is, this, oh, this is, I said series seven, <laughs> series one. Actually, this is series two, the one that I have. So we have all of series one. Oh, how cute. So we have a bunny. I have no idea what that is. Looks like a tomato right there, a cupcake, a witch, and then the mystery one. And this is um, the silhouettes for series three. I believe this one is series three. Let's put together this witch. Now, just like regular potato head, you can switch out the pieces as well. This is just another fun and neat way to collect your favorite taters. 
What's also fun is if you've watched a lot of my Mr. Potato Head videos, I did a lot of Toy Story Mr. Potato Head um, themed videos in 2019 when Toy Story 4 came out. Um, you will see that we're gonna probably be able to switch these out with the other tots, which I think is a nice touch. Mr. Potato Head is a timeless toy. This witch is kind of creepy. <laughs> I don't know, it has like a bunny face. Is this upside down? No, it's not, these are the eyes. Okay, but um, it looks like she is, or he is hitchhiking. And that's about it. Okay, that's the witch from series two. Let's, I think this is series three, I hope it is. is series three you can get a banana i don't know what that is i think it's a hamburger pineapple french fries looks like he has goggles on that one and this is, looks like a construction worker silhouette then there's going to be a series four that is so cool i love that let's see which one we got oh we got the french fries how funny little hat which is actually top of some fries. Finally, this adorable little face. So cute. Looks like saying right back at you, kid. I think these are really, really, really cute. And I think they are actually a lot of fun to play with. You don't just have like a blind bag full of toys that your kids aren't gonna use. Mr. Potato Head toys really, really spread the imagination wide open for play. So if you're a collector of Potato Head toys, or if your kiddos are fans, these are definitely the perfect toys to get. Let's switch them up and see how well they do. Let's turn our witch into a french fry. Switched out just one hand and arm. And let's give this guy a different hand and a different hat. So they're interchangeable, totally fun. You can mix and match them just like regular fish potato head toys. And just for fun, I dug up um, two of series one. The first one came with a pancake option and a adorable ice cream one. As you can see, they're repeating a lot of their limbs. So, and I'm sure their facial expressions as well. So that's really, really easy for Hasbro to, or play school rather, um, to be able to release these tots because they already have all of the parts. They just have to make different themes. And I think this is a really, really fun and exciting new way to collect. Now that we have Funko and Hasbro teaming up and releasing all of our favorite Hasbro games and toys like by Milton Bradley and everything, it's just a lot of fun to see this, especially now that we have finally Mr. Potato Head Funko Pops, but this is not a Funko video, even though we love Funko. You can check that out on my playlist as well. Hey guys, this is my taterific video. Let me know what you think of it in the comments below. Show your love by subscribing to my channel, liking this video, sharing, and commenting. Thank you so much for watching and have a tater-tastic day.